Hello everyone and welcome back to Skyrim. This is a new character and I'm getting ready to tell you his lore, his history right now. I started, I did the random on with the, uh, the alternate start and it gave me this start which is cool because it's a decent start and I got these robes which are which is good for a, a, a mage. But now let me tell you about this character's backstory. Alright, obviously you can see he's an orc. Um, and he's he's relatively thin. But he, he's a necromancer. He's, he's, he's not really a warrior anymore. He... He was injured in a way that prevents him from fighting ever again. So he began studying the art of necromancy because he could never earn a good death because he cannot do battle. So he began studying the art of necromancy and he became very, fairly proficient in it except the only drawback was and I need to stop hitting it the only drawback was the his tribe um, exiled him for practicing magic the only thing he really wants out of life in general before he dies is to be renowned uh, to be known you know well known throughout the land and essentially to get back into the orc stronghold you know uh, be accepted back into the orc stronghold that makes sense he has dark dark humor and he ang he gets angry quickly he's also he's also very stubborn and well obviously you know orcs are always stubborn And I lost myself. Yeah, he, he's very stubborn and, and quick to anger. And this is a little weird. I, I used a character generator thing to generate this, and I just I kind I was looking through stuff, and this is what I came up with for him. Uh, he. he the orc stronghold in the mountains. He was born in a small settlement to like the on the outskirts of that. And I don't know why I have I have desert. And but his his settlement was a like kind of like a military outpost sort of deal. And obviously orcs are very anti magic related. They're anti magic. As I said, he he was injured at a young age uh, you know early, late teens early 20s to a point where he can no longer himself do battle the only thing he can do is magic and doing and learning magic caused him to be exiled from his uh, family he doesn't really have any any education besides what he learned himself and the basics that orcs, you know, that everybody learns. So everything he's learned, he's taught himself. He doesn't really believe in in any religion anymore. Uh, he just he knows what he can do and he knows what he wants, and he goes for it. Overall, he he has no no brothers or sisters. He was the only son born to his uh, mother and father. And they died at the time that he was injured. So he's he's very very uh, very poor and very on his own. He's been on his own for a, a very long time. And of course, right now I can't do the conjuration thing because I don't have any of the spells. We're going to Dawnstar to hopefully fix that. Yeah, these are the Thalmor robes. I made them as thin as I could get them. But right now we're going... Uh, we're, we should be, like, directly north of Dawnstar. I believe that, that that's the Dream Tower.
sh yeah, like I said, we should be like directly north of Dawnstar, basically. Uh, I'm not going to worry about the armors, the Black Assassin armor, Phoenix Assassin armor with him, because I'll just find it as I find it. I'll just basically work at getting the uh, the Dragon Words, because obviously he's going to use them, because he's a mage. Well, the uh, Summoner, but those will obviously help in battle. And who wouldn't want the extra help of shouts? What is this thing? What is this though? I don't know if there's actually anything really good under here or not. I guess I could check. Won't hurt. I'm a bit framey. Oh, there is a chest here, okay. Yes, I still have Lockpick pick, pick Pro because I don't have really the time. I mean, this is for YouTube. I, I don't really have the time to sit there and pick every lock I run into. So I just have that so I can just be done with it. I am not in any way done with my other character. Um, actually, let me see. Actually, we're going to have to go save this game really quick. <laughs> yeah, I am in no way done with this character. She is uh, definitely going to be played more. I just really wanted to change it up and play a new character in a way that I never have before. So, I would like to reintroduce you to Thorvik. At least that's what I think the, his name was before. I don't remember. Uh, I will be looking on the Nexus for a dwarf race, or a Dwemer race, because I totally want to play as one. And then I can uh, get the spells for the, uh, the creation stuff like that. It'd be really fun to play as a Dwemer, I think. And if they, like I said, if they have the spells for the Dwemer spells, you could summon the the creation, you know, the creations. And instead of using magic, it uses, st or instead of using magic, it uses your stamina because you know you're building it. That'd be pretty cool, I think. All right, I'm gonna pause it, and we'll be back with Thorvik in just a few minutes. All right, welcome back. But neither one of those is really good for a, you know, necromancer. So I, I, I did that. I did it a third time, and this is where I ended up. We are back. I think these guys were... Uh, 
Um, I believe ESO did a thing on these guys. On this, what happened here. This place here. So that is actually already almost gone. But his main attribute is going to be summoning. But for now, I just saw a red dot in the water. For now, I have to use the structure. Until I can get a, a conjuration book. Conjuration is going to be obviously the next thing, or uh, destruction. Those are the, that's the magic he's mainly going to focus. Is going, he's going to focus on is going to mainly be conjuration, and secondly will be destruction. And I did say with him, I'm not going to worry about the armor. Oh, there it was. Let's see if they have anything good in here. Not really. Take those soul gems though. And I'll take the garnet. Resist shock, carrying capacity, and resist magic. That'll all be really good. Doesn't need any of that because he won't be actually using a weapon. That should be the Jarl's house right here. And have an enchantment added. table in it. We need to work to find Who do you think would threaten like war in our old war rooms? We're not sold. I don't know what that that song is. I just was making noise. Yeah, it's only it only tastes really good on pancakes. And I've already said it's not the maple syrup. For some reason, butter just tastes really good when it's melted over pancakes. It's like pancakes were made to go with butter. Doesn't matter either. It doesn't even have like it, it doesn't even have to be like, you know, the good expensive brand of pancakes. It's just pancakes. Hey look, a wizard. to master the arcane arts. Uh, I'll take that. I'll take that. I 
I'll take that. I'll take that. I'll take that. Can't get that. What can I sell you? Take it. 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 Time to read some books. Nice. Back. Magic. Uh, don't have 116. Very. Another fine day in Dawnstar. This is going. We won't be able to defend our own tires. Nonsense. All right. Flame Atrion Notch. Actually, you know what we're gonna do right here? Do, 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 do. Now we just gotta go south. Head towards White Run. So, I'm not gonna bore you guys with my walk. So, if you guys enjoyed, please leave a like down below. And subscribe for more awesome content coming your way each and every day. As always, thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you all in the next episode. Alright guys, welcome back. Uh, gonna do a little bit of a quest here. I've, I've had my first few battles. I am... I am uh, level 3. And you can see I've got two points in Conjuration, and I put both points into Magicka. So yeah, I can now summon those. I have... Uh, the construction or conjuration dual casting just because uh, I need to get up two more levels to do this one so I can actually have the flame action arch more often even though they suck I was fighting a Nord and the flame action arch kept hitting me instead of the Nord lady we're gonna do this quest uh, to kind of start this storyline because I would like to Oh, um, Cicero is stuck. This character Can't would probably be best as an assassin. I was transporting my dear sweet mother. Well, not her. Her corpse. <laughs> She's quite dead. I'm taking mother to a new mm. home. A new crypt. But, ah, wagon wheel. Damn yeah, I think this character would work best as an assassin because... Don't you see? I'm not going to be able to... Really... <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not going to be able to like really tank yes, damage or anything, so it's all going to be dependent on what my familiar, you know, my Just summons can do. Off the road. Dr. Lorius, he has tools. He can help me, but he won't. He refuses. Uh, convince Lorius to fix my wheel. Do that, and poor Cicero will reward you with coin. Gleamy, shiny coin. Okay. That is a light tap on my right click. And you you guys see what what it's doing. The lightest tap on my right click it activates it. <laughs> 
Like, I'm, I'm serious, this is insane. See? I was sneaking around their house and stealing. That Cicero fella? <laughs> Tell me something I don't know. <laughs> Crazy fools already asked me about five times. Seems he's not satisfied with my answer. Why can't he just leave us alone? So what's the problem? Pay me? You think this is about money? Talking with the Have game. you seen the man? <laughs> he's completely out of his head. The jester here in Skyrim? Ain't been a merry man in these parts for a hundred years. And he's transporting some giant box. Says it's a coffin, and he's going to bury his mother. Mother, my eye. He could have anything in there. War contraband, weapons, skooma. In no way I'm getting involved in any of that. Uh, <laughs> we'll be nice what? to Cicero. And just who in Mara's name are you, anyway? Hmm? Come here, telling me my business. And for what? To help a, a, a fool? You should help him. Look, I, I... Yes, you're right, you're right. Feller might be nutters, might not. The fact is, he needs help. If I turn him away, what kind of a man am I, huh? Look, um, thanks. And I'm sorry for my unneighborly reaction. If you talk to Cicero, you be sure to tell him I'll be down to help soon. Good l Why are you so touchy? Uh, we're actually, we're actually right north of Whiterun, too. You need something? Not from you. Poor mother! The guard, yes, I needed something. Home seems so... While I'm playing Skyrim, it's it's safe to assume I'm talking to the game unless I say babe. You you did? He has? Oh, stranger! You have made Cicero so happy, so jubilant and ecstatic, but more, even more. My mother thanks you. Here, here for your troubles. Shine. Gold. A few coins for your kind uh, deed, and thank you, thank you again. <laughs> All right, guys, we will be back in a moment. Alrighty, we are back. I was, I was in the right make area, just the wrong model. <laughs> the problem is, the only thing I could see was was the passenger side door. The passenger side front door, part of the back door, and the passenger side front tire. Alright, you're about to see us battle right here. Or not. 
Apparently we aren't going to battle. Let me guess. Someone Go stole away. your sweet roll. Ooh, I'll take a that. They annihilated these guys. Yeah, see, we're just north of. Oh crap! I thought that was a wolf. I was like, ah. <laughs> No, it's not. That's close enough. You don't see me. Hi. Get up there. Get up there. Get up there. Stay behind me, Ashna. Oh. Stop with the hitting of me. Woo! Can't wait to Ow, stop like you're getting me. I should do your job. One down. Keep going. Kill him more. Oh, crap. Why do I keep doing that? You go kill the bandit mage. I'm going to search. Oh, he killed him. Oh, there's a lot of them. Run, 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 run. Horse. He won't. <laughs> Really don't care if this horse dies. It's not mine, so yeah. We are gonna enlist our first follower. It's a fine day. Lead the way.
Do do do. Time to go back and do battle. I like the animations that I have. The I forget what they're called, the Mystic Knight? Or something like that? Ow, oh, fire's bad. Stop it! Stop it! Thank you. I'm not using fire, I'm using a flame atronarch. Who socks, by the way. Worst summon I've ever used, I swear. Hits me half the time. Blue stuff, blue, blue skull armor. Never seen that before. All right, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this little episonic thing. If you did, please leave a like down below and subscribe for more awesome content coming your way each and every day. As always, thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you all in the next episode.